This is our 2017 Volkswagen Golf R. What a fantastic example in the best color combination. The stunning lapis blue metallic with a gloss black trim, gloss black 19 inch Pretoria wheels. It's got the privacy glass. It's also got a full Maxton ground effects kit all the way around. It looks fantastic. This one's got the much sought after and highly desirable panoramic roof. It's got a full service history with three stamps in the book. This is the 310 horsepower version, not the 296, which um, happened later on in the facelift life uh, in 2000, end of 2018, when they put the restrictions in the uh, exhaust system to reduce the emissions and lost some power. So this is the full fat 310 horsepower version Just turned three years old got two keys full book. Uh, sorry. It's got a two keys It's got uh, the stamp service book and paperwork. There is no book pack with this vehicle. My apologies It's got the um, LED headlights with the daytime running lights You've got the gloss black features to the front this car's had a full d-chrome as well so everything's been de chrome including the r and grill etc now this has had a recent set of full all round of michelin pilot sport tires uh 4s so really really top end tires here all with pretty much brand new tread on them uh, front brake pads have also recently been replaced so they're like new Bodywork is superb. You can see there, all that's been de-chrome. Ground effects, side skirts as well. The gloss black wing mirrors. Of course, the panoramic roof there. Looks absolutely fantastic, this car. Machine polished to a mirror shine. Again, the rear tires, almost new. Those twin chrome exhaust outlets on both sides. And then the Maxton design rear diffuser. And the de-chromed rear tailgate badge. You've got the full LED headlights at the back. Underneath here, you've got your space saver spare. Your locking wheel nut, jack, etc all there as it should be so if we close the boot moving on to the rear compartment The Alcantara and fabric seats. Got the ambient lighting in the doors. Heated power folding wing mirrors. The R embossed Alcantara and fabric seats. Of course, we've got the virtual dash here as well. So if we sit inside, two keys there, by the way, as well. The so virtual dash, you can display the nav on the main screen. Uh, and then here you've got your touch screen, which is really good, responsive. Uh, obviously, you've got multiple different sources you can use, uh, including Bluetooth audio, internet, auxiliary, etc. Phone, navigation. Um, you can also have Apple CarPlay, Android Auto, or use a mirror link from your phone onto the main screen, and then car, and your main menu there with the different uh, with the different sub menus. Really good system to use. Heated seats, two, two zone climate control, parking sensors front and rear with an on screen display. You've got different modes of driving there as well. 
I just turn off the parking. So you've got normal, race, individual, and eco. Of course, the individual you can configure yourself. You've got a hill hold assist, um, handbrake electronic, cup holders here, armrest. Bear with me. There you go. Cubby hole there. And that slides as well, so you can rest your arm on it easier. Adjustable steering column. Glove box here with a paperwork and service book. It's a lovely frameless rear view mirror. Sunglasses holder. The panoramic roof switch here. And then the music system with tweeters in the A pillars. Automatic lights, got adaptive cruise control there. And this controls what you display on this uh, virtual dash. So for example, if you wanted to go through your audio or you want to go through your telephone, you can do it all on this, uh, on this screen here, which you need to put a new battery in the key, which I will do tonight. So yeah, really, really good and easy to use. But there's our flat bottomed steering wheel uh, with the contrast ditching. Stainless steel pedals there as well. Moving round to the passenger side, it's much of the same thing. The illuminated entry sill plate there. And the rear passenger again, much of the same. Really is a stunning bit of kit. Fast five doors it's practical reasonable fuel economy if you drive it sensibly sounds good four-wheel drive just doesn't get much better and, and to me the if you're going to get a golf fire it's got to be the mark 7.5 it's got to be the excuse me the number plate covers fallen off it's actually got um while it's here let's might as well take it off um but it's actually got these uh, really nice uh, 3D gel plates, which I think look pretty cool. <clears throat> Can't beat a Golf R. Probably one of the best hot hatches you can buy on the market today, in my opinion. Really is in lovely condition this. All the wheels are unmarked, body works unmarked. Not covered in stone chips. I mean, yes, there are a couple as you'd expect, but certainly um, not peppered at all. Really nice. Very happy with it. And that is pretty much it folks, that's our 2017 Golf R. We do of course offer some superb finance packages, we offer nationwide delivery to your door. And we offer warranty packages as well. So if you'd like to discuss any of those options, please don't hesitate to give me a call, email, text and we will run through those with you. These cars never hang around long, they always sell pretty quickly so I would suggest uh, if you want this golf file, please get in touch very quickly. That's all for now. Thank you very much for watching this video. Hope you found it informative. If I can be of any help, let me know. Have a good night.